Excerpt from Esperanza Rising by Pam Munoz Ryan. Miguel, why must we always drive so far to shop at the Japanese market when there are other stores closer to Arvin? Some of the other market owners aren't as kind to Mexicans as Mr. Yakoda, said Miguel. He stacks many of the things we need and he treats us like people. What do you mean? Esperanza, people here think that all Mexicans are alike. They think that we are all uneducated, dirty, poor, and unskilled. It does not occur to them that many have been trained in professions in Mexico. Esperanza looked down at her clothes. She wore a sweatshirt dress that used to be Mama's, and before that, someone else's. Over the dress was a man's sweater with several buttons missing, which was also too big. She leaned up and looked in the mirror. Her face was tanned from the weeks in the field, and she had taken to wearing her hair in a long braid, braid like Hortensia's because Mama had been right. It was more practical that way. Miguel, how could anyone look at me and think I was uneducated? He smiled at her joke. The fact remains, Esperanza, for that you, for instance, have a better education than most people's children in this country, but no one is likely to recognize that or take the time to learn it. Americans see us as one big brown group who are only good for manual labor.